Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. Uh, this is Kippy Tesla. Welcome to episode 12 of Chrono Cross. Last time we recruited four, five new party members. Can't even remember. Two more, two more left. So we recruited whom? Norris. No, wait. It's not the order it went in. We went for Zappa first. Van, Norris, Fungi. That's four. I, I think that's it. Well, yeah, Radius too. Five if we count Radius, but he's like, he's obligatory. I think Norris is too. I'm not sure now because when I read the, the lines out loud, I it's very hard to fight, follow the story. So that's something to practice on. And damn it, Kitty. Just the moment, the moment I started uh, like the, the intro and everything, just before the stream, she came over here and just started screaming in my face. And now she's kneading non-stop. I think she knows what's up. I'm not going to be looking at her for the next two hours. <laughs> so she's restless. All right. First of all, hey, sis. <laughs> what was the last thing there? It is the it is basically chrono, the Chrono Trigger main theme in uh, the... What's it called? The time, the 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 dream, the time dreams, but it's kind of you know it's a reused melody, just repurposed. It's not identical, but it uses the same melody. A lot of tunes in Chrono Cross carry the main Chrono Trigger theme. Chrono Mantique, the main travel theme, will have once we have like full travel at some point in the game. Um, that one's pretty much Chrono Trigger, just like in a ballad form and so on. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, the dream, the time dreams, yeah. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's okay. Mama, tata, ako gledate i ljubica vam kaže zdravo. My parents might be watching. They did yesterday. I didn't know. I found out afterwards. So, they might be today too. All right. Um, 29, 29, 22... 29.12, so which is the last save that we had? The the middle one, definitely. I just want to make sure I loaded the last save. <laughs> okay, so we are in the home world for Dragonia. Do I have sound? Can I hear you, game? Oh, okay. I can, I can hear it. All right. And uh, there's a party member. Remember those incubators I was looking at? Egg incubators? Yeah, they're actually in this world, so we gotta redo this dungeon, kinda, in another world. This is optional, but I'm doing it. It's continuing what I did yesterday. So we could totally forego this part. It's gonna be the head... Head, butt, and cheeks. <laughs> head... What was it? Head, body, and tail puzzle. So first, as we are... We don't want to, we just want to push it here. Because now we know everything. Okay. Head, body, tail. Yeah. Now this part has moved here. I can activate the switch. Which will open the stairs way over there. Now I got to switch head, body and uh, tail combo. This thing, well, head, body, and tail refers to my three party members, of course. So that plate over there switches the first and second one. And I have a button here to switch the first and, like, to push them, actually. First one to the third, the third to second, and second to first. So, just using the party configurations, we solved this room. Which we did, I think, two episodes ago. Yeah, I realized I'm not explaining as much as I did in the past <laughs> while editing some of the videos, so I want to do that more. You know, for people who just walk in. Yeah, so now we want to do... So that was 2... 2, 1, 3. Now we want to switch... them there. And then use this. Now it's 2, 3, 1. Or body, tail, head. Actually, it tells you after you activate it. Yep. 
And it said, let it be body, tail, then head. Because Lynx was the head and he's last now. And that moves the stone somewhere. We'll see where. It should be far enough for me to reach something this way. Oh no, it's it's there actually, I see it. I expected it further. So you can see it moved just enough so I can step over and pick that chest up. Open it rather. We got Dinadorite. How do you even pronounce that? Dinadorite? Now it's, no, it's hurting me. No, not in items. It will be in equip, I think, in the accessories at the bottom. Dinadorite. Dinad Dinadora Mountains. Okay, Dinadora Mountains, Dinadorite. Dinadorite. Dinad what? That's just such a weird word to say. <laughs> Dinadoro, Dinadorite. But yeah. yeah. I don't know if you remember <laughs> Dinadora Mountains. I know, sis. In the first game, in Chrono Trigger, Dinadora Mountains were the... We had a quest there with Frog and... Was it Frog, I think? Dinadora, yeah. It was in the on the poor continent. <laughs> Tail, body, head. Wait, did we did that one, did we? Tail, body, head. Okay, that doesn't work. Then fix him again. Do this. Zoop. Actually, no, no, no. I shouldn't have. It's much better when you know off the top of the head. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Tail, head, body. Okay. Tail, head, body. Where does that go? Oh, wait. I didn't even... I was looking at the wrong stone previously, but that's okay. That's actually perfect. There are no enemies here, though. They're, they were there in... Uh, Another world. But in home world there's not nothing. Thunderstorm. What the hell is a tender thunderstorm? <laughs> there it says. Will it be in elements? I guess. No. It's not an element. Oh it is! Only a finite color yellow causes a series of thunderbolts to occur. Wow, is that like a summon? What is that? Whatever it is, I want it. I want that. Zappa? Yeah, I'll give it to Zappa. Oh, but they need to be yellow. I see. So you gotta have yellow innate to use that. Who? Anybody here has... Norris? Are you yellow? Yeah, Norris is yellow. There you go. Norris, you can use this shit. Take this shit and use it. Instead of magnify. Serious of Thunderbolt. Oh, I really want to see that one in action. I hope we run across an enemy. And now to level 6 for Zappa. We'll put a magnify. I'm going to say a magnify here. I don't use it. I should, really. I keep... It's, it's a scary spell, because temporarily multiplies elements damage by, by 125. But, it does that for both uh, enemies and allies, so that's why I didn't use it yet. I think I think I didn't use it a single time in this, uh, in this run. Okay, so we need to move this a bit more. This stone thingy. Oh god. Is 
there no shorter route? Is this the best what I'm doing here? Let's swap them now. So two and one, and we go to one, three, two. So head, tail, body. Head, tail, body, yep. Damn, it's not it. Head, tail, body. What comes next then? If I push it one more time, after switching back, we go back to the original one. So here, did we try this? I'm not sure because I know I like I flipped it once but not sure if I checked if something changed I just want to make sure huh is it where I need it to be now damn I wish I went right first yep it's exactly that's the one I skipped so tail body head backwards yeah that one takes me where i need to be why did i go back <laughs> i was going the right way okay let's do this again i was all excited forgot yeah i just need to go this way now <laughs> it's the longest route to get to the switch we need and that should drop the entire middle portion into the ground yeah, there you go. And now we can all go back to normal. What the hell? Was it kind of more dramatic and slower than than in another world huh so I gotta flip Zappa and Norris again to have my party back at normal Joop. There you go. So that's beam number one. Save the game, and on we go to beam number two. We shouldn't have bosses this time around, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, there's no one there. I mean here. Should make this... You know, it should make it easier this time around. Puzzly, puzzly. Chest. Iceberg. Oh my god, these are some awesome elements, but I'm gonna guess only if if innate color blue Yep, only if innate color blue, so that's for someone who's innate blue 
don't have any such person in the party right now. I don't think we have anyone blue in the new party at all. We gotta gain the trust of our old friends if we were, were to make any progress. But they all think I'm Lynx now. They think I'm the villain of this story. No wait, actually I want it here. And then afterwards we'll go the other way. Oh Jesus Christ, <laughs> the controller goes brrr. I wasn't expecting that. That's okay, we can try the Norris. Norris is yellow, right? I think. Zappa's red, yeah, so Norris has to be yellow. Oh, you missed. Never mind, Lynx, your turn. I like the one, two, three combo because every time you hit lower, lower ones have higher accuracy, right? But every time you hit, your accuracy goes up, so less chances of missing, like this guy here. And uh, look, now it would have been at, the strongest hit would have been at 90%, the weakest at 99%, almost, almost impossible to miss. Alright Norris, can you do it? Alright, he's got six levels. Thunderstorm. Let's let's see what this does. Oh, single enemy. I guess that's okay. Oh no, it's all enemies. It says they're all enemies. Holy shit, that's strong. I thought I was gonna kill them. It didn't, because these guys are like, what, mini bosses? But still. They, they should be weak to green, right? Or I just do my thing, hammer throw. I should really hit him with something yellow. Like that. First time using this too, I think. Arrow Blaster. No, it isn't. She's still alive! I, oh boy! What did I get myself into? You're not even... This doesn't seem like they give a shit. 200. Ooh, if they hit Lynx, he's dead. Okay, it's just Zappa who's now dead. Oh boy. Sun Shower. Let's see what Norris can do with the Sun Shower. Not really what I expected, this is bad, it should have healed. Oh, wow, god. Okay, I'll just continue from the last save. Which was somewhat close. Hey, I can revive one of them. Lynx, I'm gonna say. Please don't... Okay, Norris can take some damage. Can you revive? Yes, you can. Alright, revive Zappa. Then Norris can do the rest. Holy shit! So easy to mess up. He's still alive. Look, he's weaker, but he's still alive. And the other one's gonna attack anytime soon. 
Anytime soon? Anytime now. Heal all, please somebody. Have a heal all. No, they don't. Let's give the Lynx here a capsule. I think that would be the best choice. Okay. To Zappa should be able to heal everybody. I think he even has heal all. There you go. Should be higher than a higher tier heal. Yeah. Pretty good. Okay. Not so scary anymore. He's dead. Okay. Just one guy left. What's the meanest green I have? Well, not much. Feral cats? Should I send cats at him? What's the last one? <laughs> Here, I'm gonna try it. Fuck it. <laughs> you only live once. Brush. If he's attacking next, <laughs> he could just wipe us all out with one go. Attack the cyborg. Nice, okay. Let's try the spiral ray, though it's his color. I should attack him with green, I don't have enough green. It is still alive! Okay, not good, not good. You know, remember that you only live once? Well, you only get to die once. <laughs> Oh boy, oh, I think he heard me. Oh, everyone's dead. Oh, they're not. Even with the magnify. She. I was sure that's it. We're all goners. Goodbye, boys. Push basher. We gotta green this up. There's no other option. Anything green, I don't care. Arrow saucer. He, he actually heal Zappa. Zappa Parappa. <laughs> oh, they are now, are they? Whatever green, just give it. Arrow saucer, sure. Make three greens. Just so we weaken it. Oh, I didn't even realize we have the yellow status. Sprains, I guess. Yep, we got sprains. And I don't have the sprain heal. Whatever it's called. Shit. I guess we're gonna go heal Lynx. We got nothing green left, I think. Oh, Aero Saucer, sure. Should be stronger because of the green field. Yep, there you go. With just one arrow saucer, which is like a lower tier. What is that? Level two? Green. I didn't steal from it. Maybe I was supposed to. Oh yeah, we're sp we have sprains, which means I can't move. I can't run. <laughs> You can't run when you have sprain, so use element brace. Should equip some of those on someone. I probably should have gotten here afterwards with kid and stolen from them, but it's too late for that now. It didn't even occur to me that that could be an option.
Now before moving on, I'm gonna go back to that save point. There you go. No bosses, no. Okay. It is, it's real pretty. Alright, we got the water dragon activated. Water and lightning for now, right? Earth. Whatever yellow is. I think it's earth. Yeah. Okay, number three. We have robots here. I'm just gonna go here for now. We have the invisibles. More than a dorite. And a nostrum, okay. Oh, these are some new enemies. Let's fight him. It's not the ghost thingy from before, it's some kind of a. It's Cam. Camille. Chameleon, but it's spelled different. Chameleon? Chameleon? <laughs> Chamel. What was it? Chameleon. <laughs> should I risk it with three? Yeah, I should. Oh, that's a miss. That's unfortunate. What can I do here? What's their element? No, that's not what I wanted to do. Damn it. That's okay. He'll recover faster. If nothing else. What's their element? Blue. Sure. Well, that's not... That's great. Inferno. Chameleon. Yeah, I think it was Chameleon. <laughs> Zappa here will show you the way. Very innate. Oh, they can change their innate, that's why they're chameleons, okay. But yeah, chameleon. Well, what are you now? That one's red, that one's blue. Fuck it, you get hammer throw, both of you. We can't have two blues on this board. Alright, Linksy, your turn for redemption. Do I have blue for that guy? Nothing. Icelands for the red guy. They're both almost dead. He's definitely dead now. He's also definitely dead. 
they're both definitely dead. <laughs> You know what, it would have been nice to have Sprig here with her... Hmm... With her thing. Cause she can, remember, she can copy enemies she meets. I was looking at the cat when you wrote that. <laughs> Let's go back and swap someone in with Sprig. Someone else from Kaji Salili. Teleporter. So who are we gonna swap out? I'm gonna say. Hmm. I'm gonna say Zappa. I'm gonna swap for Sprig. Huh? She's green, yeah, why not? Oh, Yubka. Well, that part just went beyond the uh, banner. Let me take that away. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, I see it now. Elements, allocate. Mm, not Norris, but Zappa, unequip all elements. Then equipment. Zappa, equip all accessories, yes. Uh, not Norris, the other, the, yeah, her. Magic defense, huh? Attack power. Shit, I don't know. Like that. And that. I got nothing better for now. Well, she's pretty strong, so... Sprig, I mean. She can only have a few elements, though. That's very unfortunate. Look at all this shit we're losing. Because she uses all different enemy skills. So I don't know what to put on her. This is about level 5. Level 6. That's all. But I do want to try to capture some enemies with her. Gaga? I think you need to weaken them sufficiently.
Miss. Slur. No, my accuracy. Ugh. Well, let's risk it. Oh, it worked. Doppelgang. Gotta learn their colors though. Komodo pop rate. Bul bulb should be green. Let's weaken him, but not kill him. Oh, fuck it. I'll try it. Oh shit, I forgot. It's gonna be double damage because it's three greens. 288. Still, they're very strong. Yeah, we gotta kill one of them, then work on the other one. There's no sense in letting them live. He's gonna do a beaten earth too, and if he does it on Norris... Okay. Two people that can take. Nice. Now, can we heal people, everyone? Damn, we cannot heal everyone. Yeah, if I do it one more, they're gonna do do double damage on me. I gotta do something. Pushwhacker, just push the yellow out. Bad eye. Okay, so what was it? Carnivore goes to all enemies. Yep. can take it mm. recover all cool saved let's finish this guy One more left. Should be easier now. Infoscope. Let's see its HP. I want to see how this works. Hmm. 
Nice, I can see it's HP. 621 out of 931. Okay. So now it'll be easier knowing what I'm doing here. He doesn't like Norris for some reason. Norris, yeah. Norris did everything green he had. Maybe I can freeze him? <laughs> Bushwhacker. 490. He's not frozen though. I can do Bush Basher times plus two. That should do something. Alright, 287 left. Feral cats to you, sir. Okay, he's almost done. Yeah, he's in red, okay. Shh, we need to defend to gain our stamina back. Bulb is defending. I don't know about the rest of them. Not bad, even with the defense, poor Bulb. I just need some, yeah. There you go, Bulb. I just need to, oh, level 1, doppelgang back, because I, I should be able to capture them now, or something. We all have sprains, though. It would be easier if I weren't trying to capture it. How do you capture them? Oh, He just died. Was it last one zero? Do you, do you get to... Did she get him? I should probably check how that works before doing anything drastic. It is interesting though, having her mimic different opponents. That's a good skill. That's like Blue Mage in Final Fantasy games. Kinda. In its own way. Oh jeez, <laughs> got me, he got me good. Oh, I wish I didn't change my party members. Wait, Sprig's got green, yeah, okay, let's get the Chameleon first. 
Everybody gets crazy cats. Feral cats, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. He changes it to yellow, he's doing us a service. Wait, what is your... It's red. Ouch! Oh god! Oh! Jeez! Okay, Sprig is not good for this level. Holy... Can I even... Can I cure her? Well, they both hit. No, they didn't. Fuck it, I'll, I'll go with the crazy option. Wow! Well, let's hope for the best gurgoyle, huh? Nope, she's dead. They really didn't like her. Oh, wow, can we just run away for now? We'll come back later. Yeah. See you in a few minutes. Like, no. Thanks, bro, but no. Okay, she'll survive till I go back. Just swap her out for someone who's not as liable to die. But, like, back to Zappa. That was pretty good. Why did I change that? It worked well. <laughs> Yeah, we need someone with better armor. Plus, I think Zappa has mithril armor. She only has, like, silver. Poor Sprig, she just got slapped crazy. Well, no, after the battle, they're back to 1 HP. See, she has 1 HP, so... Uh, so... I'll just swap her out. For someone else. Well, back back to Zappa actually. That was that was working pretty good. I could go with Norris is already yellow, so I could go with Radius, who's also green. Yeah, I could go with Radius or Norris. What do you think? Or Van even, but he's not like. Let's look at their defense. Oh, my controller batteries died. Hold on. I knew that was going to happen, so I had the spear ready. You think Radius, love? Okay. We'll go with Radius. Master Roshi. <laughs> well, I'm going to ditch her to, to save her, because she can't handle these enemies. Okay, so Radius it is. Extensive. <laughs> Uh, now we gotta do the whole thing again. Mm, element uh, equipment first. Unequip from who? Sprig? Was it? Yeah. Oop. Sprig, there she is. And then equip radius. Yeah, he's got a mithril vest. Mithril helmet. What else? We could give him a yeah dragoon gauntlet and look at that. His magic defense and his defense are awfully high. So. Maybe he's evasion, I would say, because everything else is pretty high. So 37, 18, 37, 18, 14. He also has dancing shoes. 40, 24, 8, 36, 25, 17. Yeah, I think that's good. I think that's pretty good. And 
high attack. So now elements, again, take from Sprig, whatever, like she had two. And then allocate on radius. I'm going, I'm gonna go with auto allocate, just to see what happens. Radius only. So what do we get? It's preferring the greens for him. Hmm, that's not bad actually. Would I change something? I would just put a... Yeah, I'm gonna put brace on someone. I'm gonna leave it like this actually, gonna see what happens. No wait, that's not what I wanna do. <laughs> hey dirty, good to see you brother. I mean sister, my bad, sorry. <laughs> what are you up to man? Yep. Yeah. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah. This is my favorite game of all time, so... <laughs> Probably gonna see it a couple more times. In the future. Oh, nice. Are you working today? Or right now? Why, why am I missing an element here? Did we get a level while well, I was not aware? Cure. We got that. Something that's level 1. We got a Numble. Decreases physical evade chance. Okay, that's new. Gravity Blow, we got that. Photon the Uplift, we got that. Something we don't have, maybe? Fireball. Uplift. Turn, turn, turn. Eagle Eye. Eagle of the East. Wolf of the West. Yeah, that's it. That's why nothing is there. Let's try this then. Is it gonna fuck everything up? Let's see. Ah! It did fuck everything up. What did it give me though? Well, that's not bad. I don't know what I would change, honestly. Yeah, he's usually streaming when I work too in the morning, him and Gamut, which is unfortunate. But, you know. Sometimes if I'm not doing something, like if I'm not doing something I have to think about too much, in the morning, I drop in to <laughs> see them, because that's the only time, really. Hell Soul, Electro Jolt. Yeah, I'm gonna put Electro Jolt. Brace is here, just because we have these guys. There we go, that was... That was... Something. But we got it done. Let's see how Radius fares this region. Hi zombie, how are you today man? Oh good to hear you're good dirty. Yeah. Shall we check if it's easy fighting this guy now or not even try? I'm gonna can I what if I move here? Is he gonna chase me? God, oh, Jesus, okay, I didn't hide, I, I didn't really hide as as good as I thought I did. Can the spiders distract them? Ooh, 
we're back for some more ass whooping. Ouch, that was my beautiful face. Stop that. We don't have enough for anything fancy, so... Well, you know what? I can do a Graviton. Affects all enemies. Suck on that, you mechanical bitches. As long as it's not like... Shaken Earth or whatever. Who do you mean, dirty? Is this for me? Oh, I know they're yellow, but Sun Shower. What were we? Yeah, we said sh Sun Shower is good, despite it being yellow. Unless they do two yellows in a row, then we're kind of fucked. Because it's their color. All right, Radius, Master Roshi, it's your time to shine, literally. Quick draw, oh shit, yeah. Okay, he can do that, he has two for single enemy. Okay, let's do a quick draw on him. That's what we need, we need greens against these because green is the opposite of yellow in this game. I expected more of a bang, but sure. <laughs> God damn it, sis. <laughs> I think I, the only the third one I think will be harder for um, non-Serbian speakers to understand. <laughs> Link's Awakening. Oh, oh, that's that's criminal even in my book. <laughs> No, oh, it hurts. Even though it's not their opposing thing. Half-life opposing force and whatnot. A gun! You shoot him! There we go, beat nerd. This is the dangerous part. They're gonna do two beat nerds in a row. If they do it on the same character, that guy's dead. Come on, Norris. <laughs> Chaka Norris! <laughs> uh, do we have something strong that heals? Cure plus. It's not green, but you know it'll do. Okay, Norris Chuck. <laughs> That's good. Master Roshi back in the ring. Oh shit, do we have sprains? We're gonna have sprains after this. But we do have capsules this time, so suck it. Woo! Norris took. A heavy beating. I could heal us, but I could also long shot. It's not really strong, even though there is their opposing color. I don't see any. I don't see any differences. Like Lynx's physical attack hurts more. How the hell? Do I have anything else for both of them before we go? You know what, Arrow Saucer? This is dangerous game I'm playing. Norris is like 93 HP. And he's still not dead. I didn't. I wasn't counting on that. I was really hoping he would stay dead after that one. Just not the earthquake, please. Because that would just... That would end the game right there. Thunderstorm. No heal all, no. Thunderstorm, fuck it. They're robots, they should be weak to electricity, right? At least one of them died. Now comes the dangerous part. We might lose Norris here in this turn. Well, we might also not. Kill all. Yes.
That's good, we're back. I can do whatever. Beaten Earth? More like beaten dirt. Haha. <laughs> Wait, that's exactly what he said, isn't it? Oh, good, it just hit Norris. So Link's accuracy is still where it was. Free fall. Let's try that on him. Yep, that hurt. I guess the bigger they are, the harder they fall indeed. Ah, all or nothing. Spiral rated it is. Let's see. <laughs> 20 damage. 80. Oh, not bad. Alright, Master Roshi. You have sprains, man? No, okay, he's dead anyway. I gotta do something about his stamina. It makes sense, he's an old man. Doesn't have much stamina. Was it worth it? I wouldn't bet on it. But at least we can, you know, we can fly by like this. In this group. What was I missing there? I was missing more greens in other people's... Like, what? what's the... Color. Let's sort them by color. There we go. Uh, Aero Blaster. Nobody has that. He has one. Like that. What else do we have? Was it sorted? I guess. Oh, Eagle Eye is still here. Attack first, I go healing first. There you go. Hmm. Someone else? What have you got for greens? Not Eagle Eye. Fuck Eagle Eye. Something better. Arrow, Saucer, Bush Basher. Bush Basher? There you go. And he is all about the greens anyway, so putting another push basher on him, yeah, it's not gonna help. Okay, that's a that's a, that's a tiny bit better, because these enemies are all yellow aligned, so... Well, the robots are at least, so it's much easier to fight them with the green. I don't think we'll make it to SS Zelbus tonight, though. How long this has been taken. As long as he doesn't trick me again! Ah, there you go. It's worth it for the treasure and the party members, though. So, haha. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, now I know where we are. Do we go up? Do we go down? Let's go down first. I think down is just one chest. Yeah. I remember that from the last time. Whose face? Who's the morning person? Lynx? <laughs> Here we go. Boom. Okay, we got a shortcut. We won't need it though, I think. We did go there, right? I think we did. Yeah, we opened the chest. Okay, that's 
pillar number four? No, three. Did we go there? Did we take that route? Yeah, there was a chest there. We did. Woohoo! Goodbye, sir. One more on this floor. Then we go up. Damn, this is really taking a lot longer. I knew there were less enemies, but still. Okay, Eileen, I'm, I'm coming. I hope your back is as red as I remember it. <laughs> is that so, sis? <laughs> like, oh, I'll show you a sad clown one day. Hey, Teste. Hi, friend. How are you? What's up, Teste? Coming from a busy day? <laughs> the Phantom Evil 4. <laughs> Hola, senor. Escúchame. Oh, where's the dragon thingy? Wait, 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 wait. We'll go the same as before. <laughs> I'm good as well. Happy to hear you, you're too. Oh, there's a red thingy. Does it heal me? I think it healed me. I was playing eliminations with Zombie and Mammon yesterday. Finally memorized something there, because you know I very rarely play eliminations. And tonight we're doing this. Well I'm hoping to finish Chrono Cross before the end of September, really. Because there's a lot of spooky stuff for October I planned. Like Watchkeeper faces north as we defend the fort, so we're gonna go east this time if I wanna go there, yeah. And um, there should be so some of the things I want to squeeze in October, whatever, whatever fits, really. <laughs> um, Alan Wake, um, Eternal Darkness, the Resident Evil Marathon should start right after Chrono Cross as well. That's gonna be going all the time, basically. And it's been a, it's almost a year since we finished the last Silent Hill series run, so I'm gonna wait for, with that for a while. Oh, here we go, I see a stretch there. Oh, you like Helen Wake, nice. Mmm. Damn, that really cracked really hard. Hold on, let me just close the window, I'll be right there, guys. Don't go anywhere. gotten pretty chilly it's, evenings are and nights are really cold now oh really nice well it's it's one of those games that Sasha introduced me to and it sounded stupid to me like Alan Wake what is what is it even what is an Alan Wake <laughs> you know a game with that name it's nothing like doesn't sound like it's gonna be thrilling but it's one of my favorite games now and it's in the top 10, I can safely say, and uh, <laughs> it's one of the very few games I've beaten on like the hardest difficulty. That's how wild I went with it. I think I've beaten Alan Wake four or five times. So that's gonna be enjoyable to do again for the story. The sequel is coming out 
next year, right? Alan Wake 2. I actually wanted to do that as part of the whole Remedy run. So, you know, start with Max Payne 1, 2, Alan Wake, then Alan Wake American Nightmare, Max Payne 3, then Quantum Break, the first game I streamed on Mixer, <laughs> and uh, finally Control. Control is also awesome. No, he's not walking, he's awakening. Alan Wake. Yeah, <laughs> he is though. I don't know if you know, uh, he's, a, he's a, a character in Control, so to say. I don't want to say too much, I don't want to spoil it if you haven't played Control. But there's a whole DLC uh, dedicated to him. Because Control, Quantum Break and Alan Wake have been confirmed to take place in the same universe. And there's a, there's a file, well, there's a manuscript page you can pick up in Alan Wake that is read by Max Payne, voice actor. Uh, it's supposed to be like a note from Alex Casey, Alan, Alan Wake. Who, Alan Wake's a writer, so character in his book is called Alex Casey. Damn, this is hard to explain for people who never played. <laughs> Alan Wank. <laughs> Really good games. Control has a really nice universe. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't know. Yeah, I opened everything. Yeah, and I pressed the button. That's it. We're done with this section. Now we can go up. Also in Control, that's interesting. It's not weird for Remedy. I like those little things they do. <laughs> but, um... So you... In Quantum Break, there's a point where, like, when the time starts collapsing, you can see in the, what were they called, Monarch? In Monarch headquarters, you can see a woman playing Ellen Wake and singing the song of uh, the made-up in-game band, what was they called? Old Gods of Asgard. And in Control, you actually get in touch with him, because Control is all about, like, otherworldly phenomena, so... The, the Federal Bureau of Control, the main... Here we are. Oh, not yet, I think. The main um, entity from Control, let's say. <laughs> they know about Ellen Wake. Oh, right, it's here. Do I need to activate all of them? Talk to me. Some kind of device. Ellen Cake. <laughs> Yeah, remedies are really like they, they give it their all for their games. Still operational, you say. Will my egg hatch if I put it here? This is all I've been doing this for. There we go. We got another party member. Wow, what a good sleep. Good morning. That's the voice I give him. Huh? Where did everybody go? I don't know why he has. Such an accident. My big brother! My big sister! My kid brother! Oh, you're gonna announce each one of them? <laughs> and my little sister! And my dirty sister! <laughs> it's a baby dragon. Where did they all go? Are you my mother? Really, you look more like a father to me. Will you take me to mother and father? Oh, wait, I never... Sure. Sure, I guess. Draggy, join your party. Why is he, like... Dragging the R's. So what says? Ah, oh, another red. We don't have anyone blue. So the new party, really, I gotta get my old friends back. So we got black, yellow, red, green, yellow, green, red, black, and green. No blue. No white. No blue. And all the enemies, I I bet all enemies are gonna be black and red. 
when we move on with the story so I don't know what it does I'm gonna keep radius for now we can try him what was he red I don't know we can try him out later later day <laughs> Where is everybody? They must be around somewhere. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh my god, he's turning into a crow. Wait, do I need to carry him around? Maybe that's, there's like a side quest for him, because this is his birthplace. Wait, he's supposed to be a Dragonian, right? There's a, like, there's a, it'll be a big... There once was a timeline where uh dinosaurs evolutionarily <laughs> overtook the humans like without giving away too much let's just say he is like this whole place does not belong here in this world <laughs> in our world <laughs> possible i don't know <laughs> i have been working since i got up and then finish just before stream. <laughs> Had enough time to eat a sandwich, and here I am. So, yeah, possible. I'm not. I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna dispute that. I know. They all probably left in the fort. The fort and are playing outside. The elevator, little dude, and like game over. The dragon, <laughs> dragon the dragon went on without you. You were forever trapped and starved in the basement of. A fortress from another realm. Okay, I never got draggy before. Go up again. I wonder if there's anything upstairs we can pick up before we move on. Do we even... Oh yeah, there's the black dragon light, so... I guess we can do this in a few minutes, since I'm already here. Let's go left first. Oh no, there's a chest. <coughs> Pardon me. Oh, I shouldn't inhale my coffee. That's not how it works. At least there, there's, there aren't any enemies around, so that's good. That helps a lot. Knowing how strong those robots were, this would be really hard. <laughs> Guess down first. This one should take me to the chest. Yep. Anti-black. Awesome. Didn't we have one already? I don't know which anti-elements I have for now. Let's find them. Oh no, we had a white-out, black-out... So white out recovers white recovers white. Okay, that's okay. That's just like brace ointment. I mean ointment antidote. They all recover different statuses: blue, red, green, yellow, white, and black. And panacea recovers all status effects. And then anti-black. You can equip it only if your innate color is white. Temporarily seals black elements, which is good if we fight. Uh, uh, someone whose innate is black, we can just lock him out. So that's our first anti-element, actually. But now let's go here. Oin <laughs> ointment. Anti-white. Oh, 
And we turn off the... Well, activate the Black Dragon's Light, I guess. There it is. I would still go downstairs and save, I guess. Ah, what's the worst that can happen if I go in now? If it kills me, I have a small part of the game to repeat, that's all. Not that we were fighting something here anyway. So Lyubka, you weren't there the, that night. This is like in another world, this is where we went to meet Lynx upstairs when I was still Surge in my own body before Lynx swapped our bodies. But it was in, you know, in the Peril dimension, Peril universe. Right here, I don't think anything's gonna happen. Is it though? I'm just going out of curiosity, I forgot. Nope, nothing. He put the, f not the frozen flame, the dragon tear here. We looked each other in the eyes and we just swapped the bodies. And then he inside, um, yeah. Then he inside Surge's body tricked Kid. She approached him thinking he was Surge for a second. And he stabbed her with a knife. She's, I haven't seen her since. So she she's mortally wounded. And, you know, then I ended up in the space between dimensions where I met Sprig. I think you followed from that point onwards. But that was all in the alternate, in the in another world. We're back in home world now. And we can't go back to another world, so Kid is in an alternate dire direction. Yeah, Lynx is in Surge's body and Surge is in Lynx's body. I'm actually, this is Surge, it's just... But because he looks like Lynx, the game just says, yep, you're Lynx. <laughs> I mean, they had a whole conversation about that. Okay, we're done with this. Let's go get the final party member I think I can get now. Too bad I can't fast travel. I gotta go through this. How do I get the chests down there though? I, I don't know how to do that. The hot doggity is gonna attack if I do something. So. Yep. Well, I'm gonna be stuck here as Lynx for a while. Maybe three episodes. It's gonna take a while. There's a lot's gonna happen and a lot of revelations. But they're all... Yeah, I'm gonna go with feral cats. That's why I'm rebuilding my uh, party again. Because... Well... All of my friends think... I'm dead. And Lynx is, is in my body. They know about that part, they figured that out just before it was, you know, too late, but... Ice Blast is single enemy. Let's do a Thunder... Thunder Storm. Okay, the cat burger is done. Two hot doggies left. Could have taken out one more, huh? Anything blue? Cure plus. Critical.
There must be a way to get down there. John would know when I catch him one of these days. I'm gonna ask him. Do you see that down there? It's frozen lava. So there must be somehow I can get over there. Maybe through that lava boy down there? Can I go down there? Maybe if I kill him, I'll wait for him here. Try to ambush him. Ha, ah, asshole! Oh boy, oh, two lava boys, two hot doggies. We gotta use all the blues we have. Starting with feral cats, which is actually black, but pretty good damage. It's a good start. It's their turn. We're just a doggity. Sun shower, I guess. Wait, what else do we have? Ice blast. Yeah, let's start with something crazy. Sun shower or thunderstorm. Let's do a sun shower. I still have one level left for healing. Also attack, I don't know. That guy, Lo Lava Boy A. Okay, he's weak. Fire breath, not good, not good. Uh, oh, zero? Okay, I don't mind. Let's see how Norris handles it. Two what? pushovers, huh? Let's long shot him, I guess. Still alive. Am I burned? Yeah, I have burns. Anybody got medicine? No, we didn't carry that for some reason. Graviton. Okay, two out of four dead. Three out of four dead. It's its turn. Finally. Cogbite. Ah, it's spiral cogbite, I guess. Really, no medicine. What am I? Like, no ointment. Nobody has ointment. That takes longer than I would want it to, but what can you do? Got a bunch of infernos. Oh yeah, burns. Uh, use ointment. I can get down there. Okay, can I get down there from below there? Oh, I see. I remember where I am. Yep, yep. Still doesn't get me to the room with chests, but I gotta remember to ask John next time we meet up or when he's co-hosting with me. 
Fuck it, never mind. I'll leave for now. Can't be that important. This is all optional. Toro. All right, avoided them. <laughs> Good. We're out. We are out. Back to our boat. Board your boat. Yes. Well, it's not really my boat, but wasn't it Norris's boat? Nothing there. Should be able to go underwater now. Yes. Oh, this is a wonderful level. You might feel a slight color attack. <laughs> Just like in that... Uh, between dimension world. Wait, someone's red, no? No, that was Zappa. We, I should bring Zappa here now, for real. Instead of Radius. Actually, I'm gonna escape this battle and come back here with Zappa. Or anyone who's red for that. Matter. I'll be back with my smith friend. Does this count? No, I gotta be on the world map. Now, okay. So, leave Norris or Radius? I'm gonna take Radius out because he doesn't have... He's got good skills, but they're single, single enemy. Both Zappa and Norris have all enemy decks, techniques, so, radius, who else has something Mithril, I gave more people, like, what did I give Sprig, Iron Mail, Draggy has Iron Glove and Mail, Fun guy, Iron, Van, Van has Mithril, yeah you don't need Mithril my man, here you go, you get an Iron Mail. Am I taking his thing? I don't know if he started with Mithril. Oh yeah, I gave Harless something Mithril I think too. No I didn't. So Radius, Zappa. Radius has a vest because of his evasion, which was pretty low. So I'm gonna give that to him. Oh wait, he already has one. Who doesn't then? Never mind, I don't know. I was sure that one of them doesn't have a mitral male. Great Hammer and Iron X. Okay, Great Hammer is a better option. Mithril Helmet. Dragoon Gauntlet for its strength and... Again, Silver Pendant? What's his defense? 29. Oh, give me my knee pads. 30 defense. There you go. At least something. And then elements, take everything off of radius. What about Draggy though? What does he have? Oh, he's red. We could try him. Cough up a little breath of fire. Single enemy and cough mix. 
cough up a fireball then beat wings to magnify it. Yeah, that sounds interesting. But his element grid is just pathetic. This is just... no. I'm, I'm going here. I don't remember this area. Well, Zappa's no better. Let's take Dragon underwater. Why not? Why the fuck not? That's what I'm gonna do. There you go, it's been decided. Sorry, Zappa. My boy. The dragon's taking your place. He's got more health than Zappa. Jeesh, okay? He's got good HP. Go back to Zappa, damn it. First, remove all the... Yeah, then... Now I can unequip Van and give that to Dragon. There you go. Where are you, Van? There you go. That's what I wanted to do. Draggy gets the Mithril Mail, because it's better. Nice. Mithril Helmet on a dragon. I'm... This just sounds <laughs> too badass. Dragoon Gauntlet to a dragon. Yeah, he gets three more damage. Well, what's his magic, though? Magic attack 19. I'm gonna give him a defense 3 3, a knee pad. There you go. Dragon with a knee pad. What did we say? We took everything off of him. <laughs> Daggy. Daggy Draggy. I'll go to auto and then customize it. It's gonna be faster. A lot of reds. Which is what we need down there, actually, so I'm not gonna complain. Oh, okay. pretty good, actually. I'm not gonna... This is good. Now, since we're gonna be underwater, we will want some medicine. I am fairly certain somebody will need this, so... Uh... There you go. Lynx has medicine. We want to give it to Norris as well. I think that's gonna be okay. There. Are we ready now? Let's save. Level 17. That was five levels ago and five hours ago. <laughs> yeah, it's okay, Daggy. El Nido Triangle. That's where we're going. Go in. Now let's fight these fishes. Not that I want to, but I need them out of my way. Oh, nice start. Just immediately 87 damage. <laughs> well, that's nice. How do you do? They're yellow, huh? These guys aren't kidding around, man. Maybe I'm here a little too early? I got nothing green that's, like, good for everyone. Oh, we'll be fine. Hey, Waluigi! What are you up to, man? Good morning, I guess. Oh, what was the damage there? I wasn't paying attention. Go Norris! Chuck a Norris! <laughs> Norris can take a beating. Oh, you did get his accuracy down. Which is a big no-no. Can you do a sun shower, boy? Yeah, that's their element, so this could kill us. But I'm gonna do it. Regardless. Got a fiery gun underwater. <laughs> I love the RPGs. Now we got two yellows on the field. That is not good. We want to get that out of here as soon as possible. I, I should bring someone green instead of Norris. Yeah, volcano. Burn them all.
that did it. Volcano underwater. Oops, should have used some consumables. The uh, fish will take care of that for me. Nothing here. There's a chest over there. I should find like a star piece or something that's gonna help with the next party member. So these two guys only took me, will take over two hours, maybe even three hours. It's crazy. Let's go left first. Damn it. Okay. Now I know. And thanks for letting me through, fish. It's awfully nice of you. Will I make it? Nope. Too narrow. Look at how many of them are around that chest. Not good. Okay, now we got someone who can take care of this. Draggy. Draggy should burn them because they're blue. He's red. He should just have an easy way with this bunch. Pretty good. Actually, why? Just attack the same one. It's already weakened. A. Hey. There you go. Chuck and Norris. Yeah, Jim. Yeah, <laughs> and spewing fire underwater. <laughs> all right, we're all healed. Oh, I hate these yellow fish because I didn't bring anyone who's green. Star fragment, that's what I need. Mean. <laughs> No, uh, Draggy. It's gonna be a lot easier if I get him to do the volcano first. Or let's try his thing, his breath of fire or whatever. Cough mix. Let's see how that works. <laughs> sure, why not? Magma burst. A check on the race. Spiral ray. Schoolmate, school of fish, yeah. <laughs> Because they're a school of fish, get it? <laughs> Insta attack. I may be able to escape from this one. Cut it short. It's like, nope, no things, bro. <laughs> yeah, I did it. Can't tell where Draggy begins and where these yellow fishes end. Okay, there's nothing else there, I just wanted to check. Try to go around them on the wide portion of the road. Whee!
<laughs> I thought it was gonna go further. Never mind. All right. Yeah, the star thingy I got. Let's not forget. Time shifter book of star fragment. There we go. Looks just like an ordinary starfish, but it's said to have a secret power. We're gonna invoke that power in a few minutes. I just need to find a certain island. Ah, oh, I was looking at the wrong part of the screen. Okay, can I escape and just ignore it? Because it's a yellow one. Three of them. No thanks, bro. Okay, yeah. As long as I move fast enough, it's not gonna re-attack me. No? Whew! Alright. Now we gotta find that island. Marble or marble? This guy has navel. Is it this? This is the water dragon. dragon isle. Yeah, water dragon isle. We're looking for the sky dragon isle, which is this one. Hi there, sir. We have been warned not to go near this place, but we came anyway. We adventurers get all fired up when they tell us not to go somewhere. So you're like little kids, huh? This is the land where the sky dragon resides, but after the dragon disappeared, a gigantic monster moved in. It took away the star fragment I had worked so hard to get. Well, if I wouldn't have had it, <laughs> the monster would have taken my life instead. Yeah. I remember this bit. Do we fight him? Or is it just... Yeah, just hanging around. Are you eating the star fragment? No. Nothing here. Perhaps this could be the site of the ancient Dragonites. Like, you just have six islands with different dragon names. Oh, there's that little thing. What is that? There's a gigantic monster here. Seems that the monster won't attack you if you don't have a star fragment. Okay, so we're gonna get attacked, huh? It's empty. No, oh, it's here! <laughs> Give me the star fragment. There we go. Oh, we gotta beat him. What's his innate color? Okay, we had a save recently, so... Nice! Finally get a... A white aligned ally. We're weak to each other. I mean, Lynx and Mega Starkey are weak to each other. Let's go start with the glide hook. Anything black hell soul. Gravity blow. Let's start with like something small. Just make three. Mm, make the whole board black so I can do something with links that should blow him away. Better than this. Ah. Damn, radiation, radiation, so many puns in this game. Okay, he put a white on the board, so that kind of fucked it up for me.
Do you have anything black that attacks? No? Okay, let's go with... Uh, let's do a mini cough. Cough drop. I want to see what it does. It's a single enemy skill anyway. It burned his balls. <laughs> Shouldn't be a hard battle, considering the opposites. Great balls of fire! <laughs> you done, boy? Nope, still at it. Will Hell Soul work on him? Let's try. I missed ripping his soul out of his body. Why not? And another white. Well, thanks a lot. Let's go straight to Lynx this time. I'm gonna try something different. Do you feel hurt, sir? No? Let's roll low resin. That should get his defense down. Yeah? And then whatever I... Whatever hits him should hurt more. Meteor shower. Damn it! It's gonna hit everyone. Lynx especially. Well, not as bad as I thought, really. Norris and Draggy are blinded. I think their stamina will be impacted. Graviton. No, don't die yet. It's perfect like this. Recover all. Oh, oh don't you dare. Yeah, they. I, I can't cure them. That's the thing. Sun shower. Fuck it. I can't cure them from the whatever the white status is. Blindness, I'm gonna say. Or maybe black is blindness, white is. <laughs> I don't know. Holiness? Look, 1, it goes from 7 to 5.8. So instead of 1, it's taking 2 stamina at once. Fuck it. You gotta go, boy. He's almost done. We're out of stamina. Oh no, it's his turn. He's just doing his laser thingy. I think it's best I use the strongest thing I can use, which would be... Aeroblaster? Magma Burst? 
Electro Bolt. Fuck it, let's go with the Electro Bolt. Still alive! Two defenses. Ultra Nova. That's not good. A real dead, just one hit kill. Okay, buddy. Chill out there. Heal all, maybe? Oh, he doesn't have it, does he? Another Electro Bolt, fuck it. All out. Or I mean all in. <laughs> Oops, I pressed the trigger by accident. Accidentally. Good, good, good. Okay, they've recovered. Norris and Draggy. He's done. Good. And everybody survived. <laughs> Negate, negate magic. That's a new element. So, the real body of the monster was this small? Naha, naha, naha. Whoopee! Star fragment mine! Catch him with A. Sure. I'll do it in a... What the... I shocked! <clears throat> he needs a higher pitch voice. <laughs> I got caught. You win. Who are you? I come from faraway stars. But Starkey's ship fall from sky. Star fragment is Starkey's ship fragment. The ship turned to fragments after crash. Into star-shaped fragments? So that is why you were collecting fragments. If we are lucky, your ship might still be intact in the other world. Really? Whoopee! Starkey will come with you! Starkey joined your party. Alright, so we got a white aligned ally finally. What does Starkey have? I don't even know. Let's leave him there for now. Starkey got, wants to go home, uh huh? Anything else here? I guess not. Well, we got Starkey. That's all we wanted. Let's go towards the main objective. That's it for the side quests for now. Until something else happens. Oh, are they gonna talk about it though? Same. Okay, that's the same, so there's not, nothing new there. I wonder what's up with the red... Wait, if I use a aroma pouch on him. I'm just curious. Where is it? Where is it? Nope. I don't know what they do. John would know again next time All right back to our boat
There's the Dead Sea. I'm gonna have to go there later. What are they called? What is what called? How do I get to Marble? Oh, there we go. Like, right there. So there's nothing on the other side of the island. The octopus thingy? Wait, what do you mean? Oh! The, the, yeah, I don't know what they're called. <laughs> we had them earlier in the game, in the Forest of Illusion. It's a ghost. Yeah, I forgot if, the, if it was even mentioned. Ash. Huh? I didn't expect any visitors in this deserted village. Oh, sure. Hello, my name is Ash. I am an assistant of Sir Toma. We're here to investigate Marble. If there's anything you'd like to know, feel free to ask Sir Toma. So this is the hometown, I guess? This is where demi-humans live, away from humans. Oh, there's no music here. Because they don't get along, humans and demi-humans. Damn, I don't know. Google our uh, Chrono Cross Aroma Pouch. It should take you to the right. Like, via that item. It's this. Because we used that to lure it in the beginning, in the Forest of Illusion. Where is it? Aroma Pouch. This. Seasoned fruit cling to you. And it was following me because of the scent. Is this Toma? Hmm, hey, what's up, guys? Did you come here just to see the great explorer? Just kidding. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Oh, man. It sounds like you're forcing that laughter. Can I go? Sir Toma, thank you. You remember Toma the Explorer from Chrono Trigger? Oh, it's closed here, is it? Doody, 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 doody. Where's Toma? I want to ask him. Some question. Yeah, what's up? Ask about this village. Marble used to belong to the demi-humans at one point. Demi-humans were originally located up in the northern region, but after poor colonization, they were forced out of the mainland and ended up here. But their bad luck continued. Marble, which is with its rich element resources, became the target of the element hunters. Oh, we have element hunters. With nowhere else to go, most of the demi-humans left the village to work on the cruise ship, SS Zelbus. They, they work as laborers and are treated like dirt. I feel really bad for them. Anyway, that's why you have this ghost down here. Like, literally, there are ghosts roaming around, man. Do, do, do you see this shit? The rooms are still furnished, so feel free to spend the night if you're tired. Use the hut right by the entrance. Give me more. Dead Sea. The Dead Sea? Nobody would dare approach that place. I don't know the details, but I've heard that the place is cursed by the most hideous dragon. Everyone's afraid of defying this dragon god, but being the great explorer that I am, I plan to make an expedition there someday. Oh, so you want to know how to get inside the Dead Sea? Rumor has it there's only one way. That's door. The entrance is out there somewhere. Unfortunately, even I don't know where this door is. Hmm, let's see. Who might know? Oh yeah, why not ask the sage aboard the cruise ship SS Zelbes? Okay, so we gotta go to, uh, to Zelbes. We've seen it up there, it's north of here. Let's ask about the monsters. 
Oh, these creepy monsters? I'm not too sure, but I believe they've been here a long time. You can see them, but they have no substance. Oh, I see. I understand. I'll look it up later, too. You can't touch them, nor can they touch you. So there's no way to communicate. I think people call them the Black Nightmare. I guess they're like a bad dream. Maybe a song would wake them up? Uh, foreshadowing, foreshadowing. I'm just gonna say this is the place where later in the game we're gonna direct a rock opera. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Anyway, there's nothing we can do about him. Don't worry about it. What's new? Hmm, what's new? Oh yeah, I heard a rumor that you can go near you can hear a woman crying at night. People think it's a ghost. I've been here several days now, but I've yet to encounter this ghost. Okay, then let us check this for ourselves. Okay, he also doesn't want to do anything about the nest-looking monsters, okay? Yeah, he died in that timeline. Uh, this is either his descendant or another Toma. Remember, this is a different timeline than the one we ended Chrono Trigger on. Let's rest. You hear voices outside. Can't go back to sleep. Just voices schmoices. <laughs> Let's check it out. Let's look around. Oh, there she is. Hello there. What are you doing up at this hour? Well, this kind of reminds me of Final Fantasy IV. A mermaid? A homecoming, maybe? Mermaids are also demi-humans, yeah. Oh, you say she was crying. Hmm, a mermaid returns in the middle of the night, crying. Actually, it could possibly be that mermaid who lost her singing voice. <laughs> Mermaids are known to have beautiful voices and to sing about love and happiness. But mermaids are forbidden to sing about songs, to sing songs about holding grudges against humans. Who forbid them? <laughs> If a mermaid's break if a mermaid breaks the taboo, she will lose her singing voice. I don't blame her though. Who wouldn't hold a grudge after all that's been going on? You're heading to the Zelbus tomorrow, right? You should get some sleep. Oh, and don't forget to give your regards to Captain Fargo when you get there. He can be devious, so you keep an eye on him. So it's not the same old kind Fargo we met in another world. There's a lot of this stuff that's optional. <gasps> is that her? It's her. Yes, it is her. Oh, we got a raid from Sexy Wesky. Hello, Wesky. Hello, Raiders. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Welcome to Chrono Cross. What's up, Wesky? What have you been doing? We're going to find out. Hi, Simon. Hello. Prof Wes. Weskercho one two three four. Boop. Two point campus. <laughs> you really like that game, do you? Is it is it that interesting, really? I didn't catch it again today, but there will be days. If you're still playing it, I'll catch it in action. It's going good, man. It's going good. Really good. I got more. I got a baby dragon in in my party now, and I just. I'm about to get a mermaid, I think, or at least... It's been 12 years since I played this game, so I forgot some of the plot, but I think I'm remembering. <laughs> oh, good. Good to hear, man. Good to hear. Did you play any Resident Evils today? I know you usually mix up two games. So yeah, everybody, check out Professor Wesker. Assistant Professor Wesker. <laughs> That's what his uh, nick means. Uh, he streams retro games. Uh, he has a lot of Resident Evil Outbreak and other Resident Evils. Two Point Hospital, Two Point Campus. Recently he played 
what's it called? The David Cage game that's not Fahrenheit. Detroit Become Human. And he's a really, <laughs> he's one of the most positive people I met here. So check him out. Sexy Wesky. <laughs> By the way, if you're wondering where that comes from, Sexy Wesky comes from a Resident Evil Code Veronica parody, Resident Evil Code Puanchi, where uh, when Steve, uh, Steve Burnside was it, and Claire Redfield get to a computer, Steve hacks Wesker's um, Facebook account, and because in the previous parody, Resident Evil 1 parody, <laughs> they established that, well, Barry and uh, Chris think that Wesker has a thing for Lisa, what's her face, Lisa Trevor, <laughs> the disfigured daughter of the architect, <laughs> um, they're like, oh man, this is horrible, and then Steve in Code Veronica hacks his Facebook, and you can see that his Facebook name is Sexy Wesky, so they just stuck with me. <laughs> oh boy. The cruise ship. SS Zelbus? Fargo? Okay, so she's, I think I know who she is. And we'll understand why Fargo is different in this universe. Excuse me, son of man. Oh, there she is in the water. Irene's. Oh, what's what's her accent supposed to be? <laughs> yeah, I believe so. Uh, very possible, I did. <laughs> Will you be boarding the Zelbus? No, that's not that accent. Take me with you. I don't know what accent I want to give her. Let us go. Norris is like, hmm. What is that? Or it's a mermaid, son. No, it's not the accent. No, it's not the English accent. Oh, wait. Are we moving? Toma? What's new? Okay, that's what we just explored. Is she really there? She said, let's go, but like, she's gonna follow me, is she? I don't know, because uh, Lucia, <laughs> or Lucia, <laughs> she, hers is German, so I don't know, maybe Dutch, maybe Dutch, I don't know Dutch accent, I was just watching, what was it, last night I was watching uh, Dr. Best play Resident Evil Zero, I found out the man's Dutch, just blew my mind, thought he was British, so I wouldn't be able to do it, no, I thought it was Irish, turns out he's Dutch, <laughs> um, Interesting thing for those of you who haven't heard, so because there's like 50, was it 50, 40 something playable characters in Chrono Cross, and depending on who you take with you at any time, well we're rebuilding our party now because a lot of our people left, but yeah there's going to be a lot of people here, you can only have three of them, and depending on who you have they will say same things in same, similar things in same situations, so um, to avoid writing a ton of text, the developers were uh, smart about it and they added, they made a script that just transforms the text into the accent characters using. So the same text is just transformed right there and then, like, you know, when, whenever it's necessary for the character that's currently speaking if they use the same line. So they wouldn't have to, like, imagine having to write 50 different versions of the same line. Would be crazy, right? There's Elbus. We did see him. There wasn't this, wait. No, no, that's not, oh. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> I'm not thinking, where did we meet Fargo? That was in, in another world. We are now in home world, as the as that icon in the upper left says. So I think I'm doing this the right way. No, that was the SS Invincible. This is the SS Elbus. That's right. Yeah, I can only think of fucking Goldmember from <laughs> Hosty Powers. I just gotta get into it. 
Here's Faja. <laughs> There's a lot of demi humans working here. I'm very sorry, but I'm forbidden to talk to passengers. Oh, really? Ah, what a life. I have absolutely nothing to do. Do you envy me? You're a loser. Ha ha ha. You're just jealous. For sure. I can't wait to see Nikki's concert. That ship you're looking at belongs to Nikki. <laughs> the t he tours the world on that ship. Oh, Nikki, take me with you. <laughs> okay, this is way funnier. Like in Serbian. Or if you know the movie. It was released internationally. We are not angels. Because <laughs> it's like a quote from that movie. <laughs> I gotta take a screenshot of this. For Sister Anna, <laughs> since she's not here, she will like to see this. <laughs> I forgot about that. Uh, she brings me a cocktail when I'm thirsty, gives me a massage when I'm tense. Now this is what being on a cruise ship is all about. Sure thing, man. <laughs> Are you talking to me, ma'am? No, they can't talk to passengers, I guess. Scooby dooby dooby doo, Scooby dooby dooby doo. Have you guys been to an island called Marbule? We just came from there. It used to be a beautiful place where mermaids lived, but now it's infested by nasty looking monsters. That's where all the demi human workers on this ship are from. Hey, come on, don't look at me like that. The demi-humans say they're happy to just have jobs and receive food for wages. There's a lot of commentary in this game, as you're probably noticing. <laughs> Are you Nikki? You're not allowed up here. Only an authorized personnel for Nikki's concert can get on. Not even cats! Oh yeah, we're gonna be a cat later. I forgot this part, I'm gonna be a cat later. That's right, this is gonna be one of the best parts in the game, and I forgot about it. I just remembered, I'm gonna be a goddamn cat. That makes me way more happy than it should be. <laughs> I am going to be a comrade pussy. Magical dreamers. Anything behind? Nothing there. So that was Invincible, this is Zelbus, this is another world, this is another bunch of lives. There, there's a comrade pussy, hello comrade pussy. Why am I talking through my nose, nasally? Hello comrade. I go here. I go in here, who is here? Hello there, demi-humans, I'm a demi-human too now. I'm very sorry, but I'm forbidden to talk to passengers. Nicky and his Nicky dad, Nicky this and Nicky that, this, that's all I hear on this ship. What's the big deal anyway? Just a bunch of showy clothes and s some even showier singing. The guy's not even ripped. <laughs> uh. Hello, madam. I wish Nikki's concert was starting sooner. It took me six months to save enough money for this event. I had to sacrifice my daily coffee breaks. But it'll all be worth it when I see Nikki in person. Everybody loves Nikki. Oh, Nikki! Just looking at your poster makes my head spin. If I see you in person, I will probably faint. If that should happen, please, Nikki, squeeze me in your arms. Okay, I don't know why I gave him these posh accents. Just sounds like they would need them. Hi there. Young woman. Ha, huh, you're a strange threesome. I thought everyone was here to see Nikki. You don't look like typical fans, though. Are you fans? No, we're not. You don't have to say that just to please me. Okay. Uh, should I have said yes? I'm Mickey. I'm the lead dancer for the Magical Dreamers. 
Nobody seems to understand the heart and soul of our performance. I want everyone to get goosebumps from the message we try to convey. We're not all about looks, I hope you understand that. Off she goes. Maybe I should have said yes, but it's too late now. I roll with my decisions. Kitchen, do not enter. Oh, you can't enter the kitchen? That's where the cat will come in handy. Once I become a pussy, Vegas Casino. Oh, you, let's not go there yet. Did I save just before this? I did, right? This is the captain's... Yeah, I don't want to go there yet. That's for later. This is the casino now. That's just so strange. <laughs> Thanks, sis. Scooby-Dooby-Doo. This is the... What? The what? In... Come spend a night in our comfortable beds. Dooby dooby. Oh, a save point. Gladly. Hundred G pit stay. The bed's real comfortable. We'll be here. It's a grasshopper man. Lady Luck beckons, Vegas Casino. Oh, what is this? I did just save, so... Let's talk to each of them. Bar, we card. Karte, karte, shaha, shaha. Welcome! Please enjoy the Snaf family show! Oh, Snaf! I can recruit that guy. What kind of show is this? Oh, gee. Oh, that's Snaf. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Snaf's fantastic magic show! Is there anyone in the audience who would like to volunteer for this next trick? How about you, young lady? Who, me? Well, it does seem like fun, but uh, you're not going to slice me in two or stick knives into me, are you? Nothing to worry about, young lady. You're in good hands with Snaf. Now please, step up to the stage. Here goes nothing. Now, what is your name? Jill. Well, I mean, well, let's start off with something simple. Jill, you're going to walk on air. You're feeling lighter, Jill. Very light. One. A two. A three. I mean three. Yeek! <laughs> Who's clapping? There's like three of us here. We're all... None of us are clapping. And now, for the main event, you will now become a chair. You will be able to withstand any weight. A one. A two. A three. See, no strings. She's even able to support a fetso like him. Okay then, it's about time we brought Jill back. A one, a two, a three. So, how was it, Jill? Hmm, it felt like I had no control over my body, but it didn't hurt one bit. It was very strange. Thank you very much for your assistance. You're a phony! You and her probably had this all planned out! 
huh, you don't believe in magic. You know, in the world where we have elements of nature, casting fire, fucking baby dragons, talking dogs, dummy humans. I don't believe in this shit. Like, I mean, if they summon a frog prince from thin air, I get that shit. But this, this is just cheating, man. <laughs> Looks like I have something to prove to you. Step up to the stage. Sure, go ahead and do what you want. I know there's a trick. You're a real live wire. What's your name? <laughs> it's Jack. Well then, Jack. Seeing as you seem so impatient to see some real magic, Here's one of my favorites. I will turn you into a cat. I call it catamorphosis. A one, a two, a three. So, what do you think? Don't be afraid. I'll change you back to normal. A one, a two, a three. Do you believe me now, Jack? Oh, you just go silently. Thank you very much for your assistance. I hope everyone enjoyed the show. That's about it for today. Until next time. Okay? That's gonna be important later, trust me. Oh man, that was freaky. I still got goosebumps. You guys better watch out for that, man. Scooby dooby doobily doo. -be -doo. <laughs> yep. How did he change the man into a cat? Unbelievable. Oh, that's it. Pardon me. That's all they have under this tent. I'm just gonna go save again. Just auto save. In case I trigger something I don't wanna trigger. Blip. Stage performers only, please, no autographs, okay? Excuse me, but I need to get to work. Please, let me through. Ask about the marble sage. We are looking for the sage of marble. Do you know anything? Mm, I don't believe he's here. Try elsewhere. Now please, I have to get to work. Hey, at least we get fed, you know? I don't think it's all that bad. Please, don't make me work overtime today. I wanna go home. Ah, uh, do you know what's happening in Marble? Too painful to say. Huh? Why do you say that? What's going on? It's something the humans did, is, isn't it? I'm sorry, but I need to be alone. Did I fuck something up? Maybe I shouldn't have told him that. Oh, well. Consequences, schmonsequences. I have to mop the floors. Let me through. All right, go. Don't slack off. That's the Sage of Marble, isn't it? That old man used to be the leader of Marble. But now he's down in the dumps, mopping the floors of the Zelbus. Through this door is the Grand Slam, a world where the weak are victims of the strong. Power is justice, just what the captain preaches. Anyway, I'll let you through if you get the captain's permission. Oh, okay. That's for the next episode, I'm afraid. Well, that part of the ship will go... We'll go upstairs now. Try to win the, win the casino game. Vegas Casino. Why is it Vegas? They don't have Vegas in this universe, do they? Even if there's a 99% chance that you lose, you gotta bet on that 1%. The lower the odds of winning, the greater the excitement when you win. That's what gambling is all about. Oh, no thanks. 
I want to talk to this guy. Yes, stop. Oh man, every time I'm up, I lose. Greed will do that to you. What about you, sir? Come on, baby, damn, lost again. He was hoping for a win. Okay, let's try to win. Play what for 100G? Okay, let me explain the rules for Compass Roulette. Don't worry, it's real simple. Okay, I'm going to spin the pointer, so you just stop it whenever you want by pressing A. And you can't do the trick like in the original to pause the game, so... Uh... <laughs> yeah, I do feel more energized. Thanks, love. It's easier to do the voices when, uh, when I have the strength to do it. Oh, this is gonna be hard without the pause. Nice, that's what we need. If the pointer stops on north, jackpot! Your, you double your points. Again, I think it's gonna stop where it needs to stop now, yeah. If the pointer stops on east, you win 50 points. Okay, next. Oh yeah, I have to press. <laughs> If the pointer stops on west, you lose 50 points. And finally, if the pointer stops on south... Death! Everything you've earned up to now goes down the drain. Do you understand the rules? Yes, let's try it. Okay, you start off with 100 points. I need, I think, 10,000 points or something. Oh. Alright, we win 50. No! Minus 50. Now we gamble. Yes, double. Alright. No! Uh, it's gonna be harder in this version. Add 50, sure. Minus 50. Damn, it's really hard, really hard to stop it where you want in this version. Oh wait, maybe like this? No. That doesn't stop it? Too bad. Damn. Just start me another one. God damn it, west and south. Let's try looking at another quadrant. Yeah, double, okay. Nice. No. Oh, come on. I need it in the east. <laughs> Don't you judge me. We need, I think, 10,000 points for something important. I hope it's just a thousand and I'm misremembering, but we'll see. Nice. 
I want a rank 1 prize, I think. Keep playing. No! Oh. Okay, I'll try, try to go double, double, double. Pluck. Oh, come on. So I try to I try to press A when it's in the when it's in the between south and west. And it works unless I miss and it goes to south. That's okay, add 50, add 50 better than nothing. No! Oh, that's incredibly bad, damn it. 100 by 100. It's really harder to do it in this version. <laughs> no cheating! to start plus 50 minus 50 because it's it depends where it's starting from sis it's not gonna work every time if it starts from east it's not the same if it starts from worst or north. No, 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 no. Okay, I shouldn't talk. Just focus on this. I gotta catch it mid frame. Okay. Hope I didn't do it backwards. That's okay. Minus 50 is better than nothing. Oh, it's not luck. You can actually, you gotta stop it. For, so, to get to north, you gotta stop it when the red needle is between south and west. That's what I'm trying, that's why I'm focusing on trying to catch it between frames. That's how I keep getting double, double, double. In the old version, like on the PlayStation 1, you could, uh, you could uh, pause the game while it's spinning and make sure it's in the right quadrant. <clears throat> but here it's kind of harder, you can't pause it. Yes. Keep playing. Back at where we were. Ugh. Damn it. Yes, three thousand. No, go. Game over. <laughs> ah, you fucker. Okay, one more time. Oh, 
one more time and that'll be it for today. At least that didn't take long. This is kind of like trying to do a, a, an infinite combo with Jim in Outbreak File 2. The, the timing is that tight. I can't, my eyes are skipping. One more time, one more time. Double nothing. I need to win 10,000. Which isn't that hard when you can double, double, double it. You get there in like five turns. As long as I can keep hitting north. Yes. I think I missed it, yeah. God damn it. Alright. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, come on, no. 1400 Ooh 2800 2850 Ooh 28 don't go south please don't go south now I got a cramp in my foot, very bad timing. Don't dance around the north, go north. Yes! Okay, no, keep playing, we need rank 1 prize. Just one double and that's it. South, don't you dare go south! <laughs> no! Come on! Yes, we won! Alright, I think you've had enough, guy. You put this casino out of business. 11,300 11, points. Rank 1 prize, rainbow shell, and a rare achievement, the moral compass. 10,000 points in the compass roulette minigame. Haha, <laughs> it was worth it. That's a rare achievement that means very few people actually got it. Only 9.41% of people who played the game unlocked this. Nice. Okay, we did it. 
I think I can go save now. Or um, let's play one with the with the old cap. No, wait. I'm getting up at 6 a.m. I should I should save this for the next time because now we gotta nudge Fargo and continue the story. Fuck it. I'll do this one section. I, I'm really excited to play. So hello, sir. There she is. <laughs> Army mateys, yeah, that's Fargo. It's been quite some. T it's been quite some time, Irene Zar. You've grown up, Fargo. You have not changed at all. You are still drowning in memories of the past. Ar, what would you know? I lost everything when I lost Zelbus. That is untrue. My sister left hope. A treasure that may one day bring humans and demi-humans together. Err, you mean Nikki? Yes, and his sister, Marcy. <gasps> Marcy's his sister? Okay, I don't remember that. <gasps> that child died with Zelbus when Lucia... You do not know anything, do you? Or you refuse to know, you only remember that of the past which is it's which is fa favorable to you for you. Lucia tr Lucia tried to save my sister Zelbus, but she was only able to save the baby, Marcy. Lucia felt, felt responsible and has supported Marcy from a distance throughout her life. Look at you now. Where is the old you? Who had the passion, the desire to build a new world with my sister. I told you, the old me is dead. Now what do you want? I don't need to be lectured by you. Yar. Yar, maybe having a southern accent. <laughs> Understood. Let me go get to the point. You have taken away the song of the demi-humans. In other words, we would like for you to free the sage. Arr, I see, but why? You know that song too, don't you? Do not feign ignorance, Fargo. You should know better. Only when the song is sung by the one with special power can the effects be brought into full play. My sister, Zelbus, is dead. And you have taken away the sage. Marble no longer has its true power without that song. Marbule is now a nesting ground for evil dream spirits. Interesting. So, but so what? Yar, I don't want outsiders in Marbule. That suits me just fine. How much longer have you go are you going to be stubborn? The Marbule you once knew is no longer there. You will only find a nightmare. Open your eyes to reality. I'm not releasing the sage no matter what you say, Yar. Fine, I will not beseech you. I will not give up hope on the restoration of Marbil. I will continue to strive to make my sister's dream come true. And she slitters away, I guess. Yar. Just don't mind the total strangers. Oh, the mirror is closed here. Remember the mirror? It was the John and I said it would be important. <laughs> In the other world, it was open. The dog is growling at me. Hello, Captain. We would like to get through the to the Grand Slam. Oh, the Grand Slam, eh? So you're out for blood, Yar. Tell me, where did you folks come from? Marble. What? Marble? What are you doing here, anyway? We are looking for the Sage of Marbule. Well, well, well. I'm sorry, but there's no none. There's no one of that sort aboard the Zelbus Yar. Plus, I don't want any strangers ruining my f fun on my ship. <laughs> Thanks, sis. I am needing it. <laughs> Voice is getting tired. Sorry, I. Can't grant you access, yar. Off he goes.
Well, he's smoking. But that wouldn't be fun now, would it, Yar? The foundation of the Zelbus is entertainment. What do you say, you try a luck? Try a luck? Oh, Norris, why are you so perplexed? That's right, there's a casino down below. We'll have a little show down there, yar har har. If you win, I'll give you access to the Grand Slam, I will. But if you lose, how about you give me your boat docked by the entrance? Well, what do you say? Let's do it. Good, that's the spirit. I'll meet you down at the casino. Don't chicken out now. Ha 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 ha. Okay then. Hmm. No, not again. Give it up, old man, Sniff. You don't have what it takes. Just keep doing your shows, that's all. Enough! One of these days, I'm gonna slap your dirty face with a wad of cash and get the hell off this ship. Well, 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 look who's here. That old man has built up quite a depth from this casino. So now, I own him. I suggest you don't let the same happen to you. Excuse me, everyone. May I have your attention, please, Yar? I need to have a private game with these folks. Would you mind leaving us alone for a while? I'll clear any debts you may have. Are you serious, Captain? Did I stutter? All right. The Captain is G-O-O-D. Better watch it. Oh, thanks for the heads up. Take it easy on him. Oh, take it easy on him, Captain. Ha ha ha! Thanks, everyone. I'll be done soon. Okay, then. Let's begin. The usual, Captain? Yes, sudden death. The rules are simple. Press A after the dealer spins the compass. We'll alternate, alternate turns. The pointer will stop on north, east, south, or west. Should the pointer stop on south, where it stands now, you lose. Simple game, isn't it? Just don't make the pointer stop on south. It's a game of luck rather than skill, yar. Okay then, I'll go first. Spoilers, we can't win this one. Hehe, <laughs> you're up. Luck of the devil. Here we go. Hey, hey, you're up. Okay, I don't have to read that every time. Zoop. I think the third time, no, the fourth time, it's gonna stop. Oh, not yet, huh? And we lose, yep, there you go. Ha 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 ha, you got a ways to go before you can beat me. Well then, it looks like you owe me your boat. Don't hold a grudge, I want that game fair and square. I guess that means you'll have to swim back. Ha ha ha. Oh, you asshole. 
No thanks after that. We lost the boat. But... A vegan carpet? Where? I don't know what you mean. Let me get in, we'll get back in there. Oh, Vegas. It's Vegas Casino. <laughs> See, it's this Vegas Casino. <laughs> Vegan carpet. <laughs> There'll be some carpet. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't realize I had a customer. Please do excuse me. <laughs> so, what can I do for you? So, that's suspicious now. The cat goes freely up. Hey, don't go up there. Meow. Oh, yeah. When it's blurred, the old. Right above the sin is. The casino where we played Fargo. Something is fishy. If only we could move around freely like that cat. Someone getting some ideas here, huh? I think we're gonna leave that part for the next episode. We'll have to find old man Sneff and he'll help us. For now, let's save here and end this episode. It's been a good session. We're getting up at 6 a.m. Otherwise, I would still stay and play, but uh, should be smart about this. 32 hours already. Sheesh. Okay, it's gonna be hard to get up with no sleep. GG indeed, sis. Indeed, sis. La, 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 la. Yeah, it's time to stop talking. Let's see if we can raid someone. Takes a while for it to load. There you go. Not host, raid. Ooh, Doom 3. Thank you! Slim is doing Doom 3. Let's raid Slimmy. Slimmy Jimmy. All right, folks. That's uh, that's it from me for today. Tomorrow you can. Bye. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Wait till I get to that Zelda. You'll love him even more. You're gonna be listening to it often. That's it for for today. Tomorrow we should be doing another episode of Chrono Cross. Friday. Friday is my birthday, so I'm thinking of a birthday stream. I still haven't thought of anything, but it should be with a friend. Keep an eye out on schedule. I'll update it, well, tomorrow, if nothing else. So, yeah, that's it. Say hi to Slim, and see you all next time. Yep, Slim. I'm rating Slim. Bye-bye.